What's up everybody, Barry Monster coming at you with another action figure review. Today, from the bottom of my childhood, we were looking at the Power Rangers Lightning Collection, Pudgy Pig. Dude was one of my favorite villains back in the day, and I'm so glad that the Lightning Collection has put him out in this one 12 scale size figure. So looking at the package here, it's got the, of course that standard Power Ranger art that everything comes with. Um, good window box. This is actually, I think, the thickest one they've done so far. I think this dude looks amazing. I am so pumped to open this guy up. So let's go ahead and we'll jump right in the articulation. This is everything that comes in the box. Uh, I don't know who specifically designed it. Dude at Hasbro needs a raise because this figure is absolutely amazing. Uh, it's got the metal helmet, like a Roman type helmet. And it's even got his little tail back there. So pretty kind of standard articulation. Thigh swivel, double jointed knees. Um, out of that, which is standard, but this guy is anything but your standard figure. I, I absolutely love this guy. This thing is amazing. Single jointed, um, elbows on the arms, uh, does have a, uh, swivel attached to it as well. So you do get a really good range of motion for only being that single joint. Still not bad. Th this is the, the MVP part though. The mouth is all on its own hinge, opens up. There's a huge cavity inside. You can put things inside it. This thing is absolutely amazing. They included sh butterfly joints on here. This articulation on this thing is insane. Love it. Uh, it does come with this uh, cool battle effect like all Power Rangers Lightning does. And he's got two other hands. One's like kind of an open hoof. The other is like a closed fisted hoof. There's I don't know what else they could have included with this figure uh, to make it awesome because it, it's all great. It comes with like this sword and knife thing, like giant weapons. Uh, of course, he's he likes to eat, so he needs those utensils. Um, great figure, love the articulation. He's the third in the line of the big villains from the original Power Ranger series. I know we have Aga and the Piranha Fish monster are coming later this year. This guy's number three, and I think he's the best out of all three thus far. Um, we wish we already had Fencer. I know he's coming out in the next few months to go with that. This figure is absolutely amazing. I can't talk enough about this. He was always one of my favorite villains in the original show. I just thought he was so cool. Um, dude just showed up, ate everything, terrified everybody. Great, great villain. One of my favorites. One that kind of left that lasting impression when watching the original show. So, of course, we all have the complete Rangers, so now we got, you know, kind of filling out their bad guy roles, or the roles of the bad guys uh, throughout the series, so I love that we're sticking and doing that with Lightning Collection. This figure is one of the best ones they've done. Like I said, I don't know who did it at Hasbro. They need a raise. They need to be promoted to, like, head of the brand. This stuff is amazing. You can put all the Power Rangers weapons inside his mouth. There's plenty of room. It's a perfect toy. I, I think he is absolutely amazing. There is not a single complaint I have about this guy. Uh, just trying to think of something negative to say, and I can't. Uh, the only bad thing I'll say is when my box came in, the box, I guess maybe because it's a little bit bigger, the box was a little bit damaged. Don't care. Not a big deal. I open everything anyway. Um, this dude's great. Uh, the posability is there. You, it, fun factor is certainly there. The, the fun factor is amazing. Yeah, you know, you can just throw all the weapons in here. You want to have him fight the Power Rangers, you can do that too. Um, with the different hands, it gives him plenty of different options for fighting the Rangers. Like I said, I'd go so far as to say this may be one of the best Lightning Collection figures they've ever put out. So this figure is still listed as active. You should still be able to get it out at most major retailers. You're looking at an MSRP of about $31.99. Uh, that's with the recent you know, prices going up, a couple more dollars. Highly worth it. Get this figure if you don't already. If you collect Power Rangers, definitely pick up this figure. Um, this is the first, and hopefully of many, to come out um, that I will say this is a perfect figure. Uh, I would definitely give it a 10 this figure's amazing. The articulation's fantastic. The paint and deco are fantastic. It just brings back a lot of good memories of watching the show as a kid. Highly recommend getting this figure if you collect Power Rangers or just into stuff from the 90s. Uh, favorite figure, one of my favorite figures so far this year. So I definitely recommend everyone picking it up. Enjoy the figure. It's great. Uh, definitely thank you guys for watching. Hopefully you enjoy this figure as much as I did. And we'll see you guys in the next review.